playing is everything. Fun, yes, but also vital for their growth. It's how they explore the world and learn how to crawl, talk, walk, build, and make friends. Fun family activity specialist, Dr. Jody Hiranaka Chateau, shows us that simple toys can help you as a parent monitor your child's abilities as they grow. Have you ever noticed the toys that seem to capture your child's attention are the most basic ones? Today, we're gonna to examine your child's ages and stages of play with balls. Today, I visited with my friends Alex, who is three years old, Grace, who's one and a half, and Audrey, who is six months old. There are many different playtime milestones that we will see because of all the different ages in just one family. At six months old, your baby will stare intently at a ball. She will also enjoy grasping and feeling it, so go for one with interesting textures like nubs or tags. At 12 months, she can sit on the floor and roll the ball back and forth with you. She might even be able to throw it, although without much aim or purpose. At 18 months, welcome to the Little Little League. Your child is a more adept and forceful overhand thrower and enjoys flinging the ball to you. Which one do you think? you want to do the white one or the yellow one? By 18 months, your child will be able to recognize a ball in the real world and in a book, pointing to it and maybe even trying to say, ball. At two years old, he's refined his pitch and now starts to kick and dribble a ball with his feet. Thanks to their low center of gravity, toddlers are naturals at basic soccer play. At three years old, your sports guy or gal is able to catch a large ball. Some toddlers might be able to kick a ball toward a defined goal. So there you have it. Classic toys are versatile because your child can play in any way he or she chooses. Toys such as balls and wooden blocks are great because they can grow with your child. Thanks, Jody. And remember, even though those super bouncy rubber balls are fun, they pose a choking hazard for young kids who might pop them in their mouth. Any ball small enough to fit through a toilet paper roll is a choking hazard. This program funded in part by First Five Fresno County. At First Five, we focus on the first five years of life. We fund programs and services that better the lives of children in Fresno County. Additional funding from First Five Tulare County. Changing lives and building futures. Because it's all about the kids. and First Five Madera County, strengthening communities through the Family Resource Centers, where it's all about the kids. 